Guys, come spend a day with me for morning tonight. So baby girl was sleeping, so I decided to do a little workout in the morning. So I got me a cranberry and water drink, got my yoga mat, put it on the living room, and started stretching and doing some squats and other exercises with my resistant bands. And I got in the shower and used my favorite pink scrub that I sell on my website. Baby girl actually ended up waking up, so I grabbed her and we took a shower together. After that, of course, hygiene, brush teeth, use the tongue scraper, and the water floss, of course, and mouthwash. Been in love with these glueless wigs lately because I don't have to wear anything at night, just wear my bonnet and throw on a wig in the morning. <laughs> Try to have baby girl pick, so we pick straight today. Then off to hygiene, I use my mist, steamer on my face. I did give it to her to play with because she's obsessed with it. I use the black head remover, grab one of my water resistant bands while she's nursing. I then grab my face scrubber and go to washing my face. I'm using the pink TG headband as I just laid these edges, so I did not want to use the butterfly headband. This one's easier to take off. I used the eye cream applicator, and then I grabbed baby girl, put her on my hip seat so that I can do her hair, her hygiene, and then also I needed to clip her nails. I don't know about you guys, but what? Their nails grow super fast, and it's like right after you clip them, they're long again. Make it make sense. So I clipped her nails and then off to laundry. I decided now I'm usually going to do laundry once a week. If it overfills, then we're doing it twice, but for the most part, we're doing it once a week. I had to fill up this new laundry dispenser, start the load, put away dishes, and clean up for the day. I then started dinner, actually. This was like a few hours later, but after I put everything away, we relaxed and hung out and chilled. And then I started dinner, prepping it so that I can cook it. We are doing shrimp, rice, cucumber, and avocado mix with beans. Make sure you're cleaning all that poop out of your shrimp. We only do wild shrimp as we don't do farm at all. That's me making the jasmine rice. I don't know about you guys, but I cook my rice first because I feel like rice be taking forever sometimes. Then I'm putting all the seasonings and refilling the seasonings for the shrimp, putting some lime in it and mixing it all up. That's how it's looking, looking yummy. Then I'm cleaning up so that I can start the avocado and cucumber mix. Baby girl is somewhere around here playing around by herself during this time. Baby girl does not be on me all the time. She's a very independent girl that just wants to be in the mix sometimes. This is actually a mixture I saw on TikTok, I think. And you guys know that I love me some healthy meals, so I definitely had to try it out. It was actually good, it actually turned out really well. Now we're putting some garlic, peppers, ginger. Baby girl over here telling me to look at something. And then I grabbed her because she wanted to be all up the mix again. So I put on her on the hip seat carrier and I allowed her to help me finish up dinner so that we can actually sit down and eat our dinner i put her down for a little bit so there she is don't mind her hair literally she starts the day with her hair being super cute and then ends it with it looking a hot mess because she want to eat the hair dyes that is the food look i did that i did that i definitely did that and this is what you guys need to try this is a must try i put her in the high chair gave her her water gave her her food ate my food and we over here eating together what you cooking